don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah. I always been a winner. I always been on the grind. Like money, I'm a mind. Gotta gotta hustle over time. All the time. Right here, look at these guys. They think they tough shit. Ooh, who's this guy right here? Oh shit. <laughs> What's going on everybody? It is your boy Afro Sniper X. And today guys, we got something that you guys have been waiting for for a long, long time. And it's finally here. Super excited. We have the Bintac, guys. Woo, the S45. Oh yes, the 457, guys. And we got the double tank. We got the special edition version, guys, because you know they be hooking your boy up. So big shout out to Survival Air Guns and Ben Tat guys for this. Promo code for Survival Air Guns is Afro X and promo code for Ben Tack guys is Sniper X. Oh yes. So let's get into the, today's video guys. So this is the 457 as you guys could see. Heck yeah. Really badass. We have a stock tank as you guys could see that's located in the buttstock. So that's pretty cool. It does make the gun slightly heavier. Uh, but you know the fact that you got uh, extra power supply is is just pretty badass. Now this takes this gun from going to one and a half magazines with this just single tank that's right here in front under the barrel to a three to four magazine gun, guys. So that's that's a lot of play time. That's a lot of hunting time, guys, with this bad boy. And it is semi-automatic. We have a six-round clip, which is pretty freaking cool. Now if we turn it on this side, guys. We have the gauge located right there. So no more looking in the front to looking at the gauge, guys, and feeling unsafe, right? Because uh, we like to feel safe around here, guys. Now, another thing I want to get into about the barrels, guys, before we get into all the cool stuff of the video, guys, right? When you fill it up, the Fill Pro goes right here. If you have this back tank, it does fill them both up at the same time. So that's pretty cool. That is one question I had when I first received it. I was like, okay. I realized how to fill this up through the fill probe, right? But how the heck do I fill this up? It didn't come with any adapter, any fill thing. So I was kind of, I was left a little dumbfounded at first. So I hit Larry up and you know, they're quick to respond over there at Survival Air Guns. So that's why we give him a big shout out, not only because they're a sponsor of the channel as well. So big shout out to them. And he was quick to respond and let me know, man, all the details which I'm sharing with you at this time, guys. Now, as far as what we have on it mounted, as far as optics, we have the Sig Sauer optic right here, heck yeah, it's the ambient optic, guys. So when it's running low on battery, it picks up that light, and I could still get it going, guys, which is pretty freaking cool because some batteries be expensive. Them little circle, quarter-looking lithium batteries, man. Yeah, man, I hate paying that so much money for them. It's like 25 bucks, and you can't buy single packs. So they get you. You have to buy the five or you got no, no eye, right? That's no, uh -uh. They took care of that with this. A little, it's a little expensive, I can't lie, as far as the optic goes, but when it comes to optics, from being in the firearm uh, industry and the air gun industry, I must say this, and I say this with 100% truth standing behind it, you get what you pay for. If you buy a $50 optic, a $20 optic, That's certainly a $50 optic. Yeah, you're going to get exactly what you pay for. You spend a couple of hundred, you get something like this. I have threw this on many guns, from air guns to firearms. Uh, 308, uh, 300 blackout, 556, to big bore air guns, guys, and it has never broke zero. When I zero it to that gun, it holds every time, no matter how much recoil is going through this bad boy. You know, the only thing I've never tested on is like a 50 BMG. That could be a video. If you guys want to see that, let me know in the comments. And uh, shoot, if you guys get up in the morning and fantasize about guns. Hit this video with a like. All right, guys, so check this out. So this is what we have right here. Look at that, guys. Isn't that crazy? Now that will do some major hunting damage, guys. Major. Major, all right? And we have another pack right here, fresh pack. Big shout out to Lucky 7 Air Ammunition, which is our ammunition sponsor. He supplies all of our uh, ammunition for all of our air gun needs, guys, and is the creator of the signature slug by Afro Sniper X, which you could find on the Lucky 7 airammunition.com. So go check that out. We're the only uh, ammunition company that uh, creates a slug like that. And I mean, anybody that has shot it knows that there's nothing in the air gun game 
like the Sniper Rack 7 by Lucky 7 Air Ammunition. All right, so we got a fresh pack open. Heck yeah. He vacuum seals all his ammunition, which is pretty cool, so you know it's arriving very safe. So check this out, guys. Oh my God, right? 450 freaking seven, guys. That is a sexy piece of... Ooh. of lead right it's just it's it's, bad it's mother such a man that is amazing man i got some ballistic gel sent to us by uh big greg's barbecue big shout out to big greg's barbecue yes. if you guys are in the indiana area stop by big greg's barbecue check them out they have the best barbecue in the game i know a lot of people that barbecue i mean look i'm black man i grew up with barbecue but i'm telling you he puts it down guys better than half my family members grandpa i'm sorry but it's true look check it out let's go to the range so we got it right here fully loaded let's see what it does give him a run for his money buddy All right, guys, so check this out. So after just one magazine, we are barely, barely leaving where we are at. So how many magazines we could get out? I'm trying to get a more, uh, a better rate. It's pretty really difficult. So. All right. Yeah. Ready? That is amazing. That is awesome. Let's do it, guys. Ooh, that was it. It's green. Still in the green, guys. Look at that. Still. And that's like oh, seven mags? Yeah, that's, that's seven. Seven magazines, what? WTF, man. This is a game changer. This, this right here is certainly, this is the, this is the game changer of the year. Woo! What's going on, everybody? Hey, don't forget about the giveaway we got going on right now. Fiachi Red Dot. Go subscribe to the Top Shot YouTube channel, guys. Top Shot Las Vegas. Subscribe. Get in on this giveaway. After this is gone, guess what? We're giving away another Red Dot. A better looking one, guys. So it keeps getting better. There's levels to this shit. Guys, get in on it. See ya. Deuces. Gotta go. <laughs> get it up, bro. Hey, hey, hey. Afro Sniper X, Afro Sniper X, Afro Sniper X, Sniper X. Let's get it. We're headed to the desert. We're about to put it down with the S457 by Bentac. We're stopping to get some watermelons. So let's go in the store and pick up some melons, baby. About let's to go get, get our some melons, melons on. Oh yeah. If you like watermelons, hit this video with a thumbs up. Let's go. We got the melons. The melons. The melon. <laughs> Watermelon. Alright, so let's see. Five for a oh, five pounds for a dollar. So let's get three. Alright. And some ballistic gel. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Alright guys. Here we're locked and loaded. Safety off. Ear Always remember, guys, safety first. Ear pro Eyes on. and ears. Ear pro on. Let's take the shot and see what we see, guys. Wow. 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 We got a clear pass through, clean guys. Pass. A clean pass through. That is the exit, the entry. Over the top, guys. Check that trauma tunnel out straight through. Now let's compare it to a nine millimeter handgun. Going hot in three, two,
two, one. Oh yeah. Right through. No. No. Oh, it did. Yeah, it went right through. I heard it go boom. So as you can see, that is the trauma tunnel from the nine millimeter. What is very interesting and something I feel that we should talk about here, when it comes to air rifles and firearms, and with the air rifle having a, uh, a longer barrel, of course, and the firearm not having such a long barrel, even though that it is a firearm and this is an air rifle, you could see the air rifle actually, which is the trauma tunnel behind it, was able to keep a straight path Clean a clean pass through without so much turbulence affecting the round unlike the nine millimeter which was just very interesting guys now as you can see from right here this is the entry of the nine millimeter right there and this is the entry of the uh, 457 air gun now one the nine millimeter was obviously the impact was a little bit higher than the air rifle right but still not too much about two fingers of a spread but still the velocity really started taking a, a, a hit in the ballistic gel with the nine millimeter as you could tell because the round started curving curving straight down started decreasing but the air rifle on the other hand just kept driving straight through which is very very impressive after seeing these results I definitely will say this air rifle We'll put a deer down and get you some meat on the Thanksgiving table. Hell yeah. So let's flip it over and see if we could. Let's... So there we go. So that's the pass through from the nine millimeter. Wow. Now I wish Ballistics Dummy Lab made this gel block clear, but unfortunately they did it. But, so we gotta turn it on the side, but you, as you can see this one, that's just a straight through. No tumble. It doesn't go down, doesn't go up, just goes straight clean through, no tumble. Wow. Wow. All right, guys. So, you ever slap a girl's booty and just watch it jiggle? <laughs> of course you have. So that's what we're gonna do to this ballistic gel. Oh yes, we're gonna see how much slap, how much wiggle wiggle can the S457 by Bintac <laughs> give this ballistic gel, this sexy, tan, orange looking ballistic gel. Let's get into it. If you love guns, if you love America, if you support the second amendment, if you love air rifles, if you love freedom for goodness sakes, hit that like button and add a comment into this video because it's about to go down. Jiggle, jiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Let's do it. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go up and personal and close because I'm just dangerous like that, guys. All right, let's do it. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. All right, guys, we got double Ds here. I mean, melons from uh, the grocery store. Sorry about that, you know, my Tourette's be acting up. Um, we're gonna blow these melons up with the S457 by Bentac. Them tiggo bitties. I mean melons. Yes, what he said. All right, guys. Two tap watermelon destruction. Got my ears. Whoa! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Yo! Oh! Yeah. Ah. Mm -hmm. Hey, I go. Huh? It's still good, bro. Yeah. yeah. Nothing, nothing but a little desert asbestos. That's all right. Don't want your gun to get ruined. Sorry. So check this out, guys. Mm. My gun just broke bread. It's a communion gun. Heck yeah, it's holy. And look, I even got a snack out of it. I mean, come on, only in America, guys. <laughs> guys, check this out. Look what it did to the freaking melon. What? Look at this one. It just split. Oh my god. Ah! Is that what? French, them? Dude, it just, oh my God, it's so crazy. Dude, and it still had enough energy to pass right through the gel block. To pass right through the gel block. Wow. 
wham, bam. Thank you, man. Guns and melons, baby. Guns and melons. So, guys, we're going to see how many melons we could get through with the, uh-oh, S45. You guys down? Now, I can't lie. I'm no surgeon, but I tried to piece Humpty Dumpty back together again. But we got a half a melon right there, all right? We got a whole melon. And then we got one that's just, you know, a little droopy. That's that's that that, that that's a melon that was made in the dark cities of like Yugoslavia. All right, guys, don't judge me. It, oh, 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 he put a put a hat. Oh, okay, uh, that doesn't make much sense, but we'll okay. we'll roll with it. Now, if you can't tell by now, we're just having fun today. The next episode is definitely going to be all the numbers that you guys are looking for. But come on, I know you guys want to see what this gun's doing, right? What destructions it brings to the air gun table, the air gun nation. So that's what we're going to do, guys. So now let's see how many melons it could get through. I mean, nobody's ever done it. It's never been a question that popped in my head, but we're here now. We got these melons and my hands have been all over melons because my hands love to touch melons. And uh, yeah, why not pull the trigger and blow some melons up? Call it reconstructive surgery with Re the air gun. Reconstructive. <laughs> Oh my God, guys! Yo. Dude, that was freaking crazy. That was great, yo! Look what? at this obliteration, separation, man. Dude, oh, through all those melons, all three, bro. <laughs> yo, I freaking love this gun. This gun is amazing. So you what? guys know, melon everywhere, baby. Did we just perform ninja fruit in real life with the air gun? Yo, did we? I think we did, bro. I think we did. High five. For that. Yep. Yep. That's right. Yeah! <laughs> wow. Only in America. Listen, for all you food porn fanatics out there, I got a little something for you. Uh-oh. What you doing? What are you... What, oh. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 oh! Tastes so much better after you shoot it. Nah, bro, nah, bro. You got to do it like this. You got to, you're doing it no. wrong. <laughs> I'm doing it wrong? After I show them how it's done. Pornhub, get at me. Fisting, bro. You got to fist that shit. See how I broke it in half? <laughs> See that? <laughs> You, you gotta fist it. All right, That's all right, all right. I got you. I got you. Entry. You take your fist and you fist there it. There you, you go. You gotta it. get in there, bro. Oh, you gotta oh. mix it up. Oh yeah. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Mm. Little knuckles to tongue action. That's I'm sorry, guys. Right Hold there. on. This yeah. is turning into something it's not supposed to be. <laughs> Piece of the melon came back and got me in the sack. <laughs> <laughs>